If you're moving to Metro Phoenix and you're looking for a community with gorgeous mountain views everywhere, sunshine, beautiful sunsets, a country club, great local shopping, and a huge, and I mean huge, community park, then maybe you should consider Anthem, Arizona. Hey everybody, I'm Mike Zahn with Live Local Real Estate Group here in Metro Phoenix, and welcome to another park installation in my uh, community video series where we explore the different communities within Metro Phoenix and see what they have to offer and what it's like to live there. So in this video, we're going to explore what it's like in Anthem, where it's located, what amenities this has, and of course, what the home prices are. So if you're considering a move to Metro Phoenix, you really need to check out this video. So let's get started. Oh, and be sure to drop any comments in the comment section down below, because we like to hear your comments you, if you need have any questions you want answered or you want another community highlighted, let us know down there. So let's get started with Anthem. We'll begin with local shopping. What you'll find is that all of your everyday shopping needs, grocery stores, drug stores, hair salons, veterinarians, fast food, sit down dining, everything you need for your everyday life is right here in Anthem, Arizona. What you won't find is a Walmart, a Target, a Costco, a mall, or something like that. Those are going to be about a 20 to 30 minute drive south into Phoenix. There is, however, a great outlet mall here in Anthem, so when you come to visit, make sure you check this out. There's some really good deals there, of course. Next, let's take a look at a few neighborhoods. As you can see, the homes here in Anthem are very well kept. There is an HOA, which is very common for homes built in Metro Phoenix after 1985. But most of the homes, as I said, are very well kept. They're desert landscaped. Many of them are going to have gorgeous mountain views. Some of them out the back, some out the front. Some just as you're driving through the neighborhood to get to your home. But the mountain views are everywhere here in Anthem and they're absolutely beautiful. There are three main areas of Anthem. There's the main community of Anthem, where most of the homes are located, and then there is a guard-gated community within Anthem Country Club. This, as you might expect, will have homes that are typically more expensive, but there are some really good, surprisingly affordable homes within the Country Club. So, just so you know, if you, you don't have to live within the gates of Anthem Country Club in order to be a member of the club. Membership is open to all, mem all residents of Anthem, in fact, anybody in Phoenix who wants to apply to join can do so. It's not limited just to Anthem residents. Be aware, however, if you do buy a home within the Anthem Country Club, there is one not so pleasant surprise. The homes here have two HOA fees. The fee for the community area as a whole, and then the fee for the Country Club as well. So, just so you're aware of that, no surprises. And on the west side of I-17, there's what's commonly referred to as Anthem West. Although much of this community is technically within New River, one advantage to living and being on this side is that your water bills tend to be quite a bit lower than they are in Anthem. Water is provided by the city versus a private water company, and that's the difference. So what is there to do in Anthem? Anthem is located north of Phoenix, so a lot of the, quote, metropolitan, unquote, things to do, such as theater, sports, things like that are a 30 minute drive or more to the south into Metro Phoenix. But the advantage of being north of Phoenix is that you have easy access to the desert. So if you love to hike or sightsee, you're in a great location. You're also fairly close to Lake Pleasant. So if you like to go boating and you happen to be in, um, moving to Phoenix, check out, um, check out Lake Pleasant and check out Living in Anthem. If you're moving to Phoenix for the new Tyron Semiconductor plant, Anthem is a great location with easy access to the plant about six or eight miles away. You can also join the Country Club, which actually has two golf courses, a couple of dining options as well. And as I mentioned earlier, there's plenty of local shopping and dining around as well, including that outlet mall. If you like to explore, it's a great jumping off place to Prescott, Flagstaff, Sedona, three of the most popular tourist destinations in Arizona. And last, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention the amazing park within Anthem. And this park is huge, if not mean huge. It's got an amazing splash pad for the kids, a three-story climbing structure for them. It's got its own train. Yes, I did say train, that the kids can ride. There's also a skate park for the uh, older kids and a couple of small lakes, picnic spots, a veterans memorial, along with lots and lots of green grass and trees for shade. There's just not many parks like this within Phoenix and Anthem has one of the very best. In fact, when our kids were younger, 
We used to take them up there to enjoy the facilities, and uh, we made a lot of good memories, uh, great memories up there with, with some friends of ours who lived in the area. So again, just a great park. And speaking of kids, Anthem has a great school system with uh, its own local elementary school. Uh, Desert Diamond, or Diamond Canyon Elementary School serves grades K through eight, and Boulder Creek High School serves grades nine through tw 12. So there's no busing your kids off to a community or off to go school in another area. Desert Canyon Elementary School is ranked among the, not, it was ranked number one among the Deer Valley District Elementary School. So it's a great school. So let's take a quick look at the location of Anthem at this point. So as you can see, Anthem is located here in the northern section of Metropolitan Phoenix. If you work in downtown Phoenix, it's going to be a long drive down here, as you can see. Probably oh, I don't know, 45 minutes with, with traffic to get all the way into downtown Phoenix. But if you work here in the Glendale area, or you work up in Cave Creek, or you work in Peoria, you're going to have a, a pretty good access into or from Anthem. It'd be about a half hour drive into Peoria, something like that. If you're working at the new Taiwan Semiconductor plant, it's about right here. So easy access to Taiwan Semiconductor. And like I said, if you're a boater, you've got Lake Pleasant right here, which is an absolutely gorgeous place to go to. And you've also got easy access into some of the more popular tourist spots in Northern Arizona. You've got Prescott right here, a little bit farther north. You can go to Flagstaff over here. And if you wanted somewhere in between, you could always go to Sedona right here and some of the more popular places. Um, you're as close as you can be to these areas when you're living in Anthem. But like I say, just don't uh, work in Anthem and plan on or live in Anthem and plan on working in Phoenix, Tempe, Mesa, Gilbert, any of those places. You will not enjoy the commute. So let's take a look at home prices next. So looking at what you get for your money in Anthem, that's what everybody wants to know, right? And why not? We'll start out on the on the lower end. If you look at this home right here, it's four hundred and fifteen thousand dollars, twelve hundred and sixty four square feet, and this is the least expensive home in the Anthem area right now. As you can see over here, they rise very quickly over five hundred thousand. So, um, but there are some bargains to be had, and this is one of them. If you take a look at the home, there's absolutely nothing wrong with the home. It's got uh, nice landscaping out front, a good sized kitchen, dining area, ceiling fans. It's got some nice uh, views out to the open desert behind it, covered patio, good sized master bedroom with a master bath. And there's your kitchen again. As you can see, very nice, uh, very nice area. And your backyard is nice because it backs up to this open area behind you. So you have uh, a nice, nice view out your backyard. As you go up in price, let's say we go up to something oh, around 650,000. As you can see, it changes a little bit. Instead of 12 or 1300 square feet, you're at a 2300 square foot home. Three bedrooms, two and a half baths with a den. This one is in the Anthem Country Club. And let's take a look at some of the photos to see what we're looking at. Again, you've got a beautiful area out back to take a look at uh, a nice view. You've got an upgraded kitchen, lots of cabinets, lots of counter space, your own pantry in there, uh, living area, very nice in here as well. As we go through the house, you're gonna see, you know, just nicely appointed, good tile throughout, ceiling fans throughout. You've got a nice guest bathroom here, another one right here. Out back, if you look, actually that's your kitchen again. That's not out back. They don't have any more pictures out back. Well, out back you have that nice view of the uh, common area behind you, right here. But again, very nice home. It's quite a bit larger and it has a wider view out back and it's got more upgraded kitchens, more upgraded bath, stuff like that. So if you're looking for a taste of luxury, that's also available in Anthem. This particular home is coming soon, so there's not a lot of photos. It's, um, you know, since there aren't a lot of photos, let's look at this one. This one is already active. It's listed at $1.3 million. If you look at the details of the home, it's on a quarter acre lot. It's within the country club. Also has this beautiful view out back. 
This home is 3,700 square feet. So again, you've got a larger home, four bedrooms, three and a half baths, uh, a den, stuff like that. You've got a pool, of course. If you uh, go through the home, you can see the difference in the style and the design. You've got the beam ceilings. You've got a very open floor plan. You've got gorgeous landscaping out front on a much wider lot. You have a three car garage. You've got uh, iron entry doors. You've got beautiful windows out back, picking up those views behind you. You've got a fireplace tucked in here. Just an absolutely gorgeous home. And take a look at this office. Who wouldn't want to work there, right? <laughs> anyway, like I say, for, for uh, $1.3 million, you can live like a king or a queen here in Anthem and be within the country club. So that's it. So as you can see, Anthem is a great choice, whether you're a young professional that likes to get out and enjoy Arizona nature, or a young family with kids, or if you're seeking the country club life, Anthem has literally something for everybody. And if you like what you saw here, then you found a home. Be sure to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions, make an appointment for a discovery call with me in my Calendly link down below. I'm really a pretty easy guy to talk to. And if you're searching for homes, go to MetroPhoenixLiving.com right here. We update it every five minutes to make sure it's the most up-to-date community website here in the Valley. And last but not least, check out my other community videos right here. And uh, appreciate you watching and look forward to seeing you in my next video.